In the electrifying realm of 3D printing, 2025 heralds an era of unprecedented innovation where machines blend blistering speeds, razor-sharp precision, and user-friendly wizardry to democratize creation from hobbyist prototypes to professional-grade marvels. As filament extrusion and resin curing evolve with AI calibration and multi-material mastery, our best 3D printers 2025 top picks you must see before buying. Dives into the cream of the crop spanning budgets from $500 to $7,000 with picks vetted for reliability, print quality. Whether you're a garage tinkerer eyeing FDM fortitude or a detail-obsessed artisan craving SLA sorcery, these five titans fueled by a 25% market surge Bain and Company promise layer-by-layer legends that outpace 2024's speed demons by 30%. Skip overpriced novelties like the Bamboo A1 Mini, flashy but finicky, or outdated kits like the Ender 3 V2, Assembly Hell. Instead, arm yourself with these must-sees where every nozzle nudge narrates a narrative of boundless fabrication. Let's filament forge the future one epic print at a time. Number 5, Creality Ender 3 S1 Pro. The Creality Ender 3 S1 Pro catapults into 2025 as the budget behemoth for budding makers. Its Cartesian FDM frame boasting a 220 Matos X 220 X 270 millimeters millimeter build volume and direct drive Sprite extruder delivering warp-free wonders at up to 250 millimeters mm S earning Tom's Hardware's best budget FDM crown for its auto-leveling prowess that nails first-layer perfection on PEI beds without a single shim, clocking 95% success rates in PLA PETG benchmarks that eclipse the Ender 3 V3SE's finicky vibes. At 499ers, this enclosed enclosure with optional acrylic panels tames ABS fumes for engineering-grade endurance its 4.3-inch touchscreen slicing via Creality Print, or Cura with Clipper firmware hacks for 300 mm IS bursts, while the all-metal haw end, up to 300 drivers psyche, and silent TMC2209 steppers hush operations to 45 dB ideal for midnight marathons printing functional drone parts or custom phone stands that snap together like Lego legacies. The CR Touch Probe scans 16 points in 30 seconds, auto-compensating for warped beds, and filament runout sensors pause mid-print to avert disasters, all powered by a 350WU Meanwell PSU that shrugs off voltage dips during 12-hour hauls. Weighing 10.5 kilo with a Bowden tube upgrade path for abrasive filaments like carbon fiber, it fits garage benches, 460, 466, and 475 millimeter footprint. Its USB Wi-Fi connectivity beaming G-code wirelessly for seamless octoprint integration. Priced at a steal against Prusa's entry kits, it boasts 20% faster assembly, 15 minutes out of box, and a 12-month warranty extendable via Creality Cloud, Forums ablaze with S1 sorcery tales of sub-0.1 millimeters tolerances on benchy boats that float flawlessly. The PEI spring steel bed peels prints like butter, and dual Z-axis rods banish wobbles for tower test triumphs, while the extruder's 60 millimeters S retraction nips stringing in the bud. Number 4. Any Cubic Viper 2 the Anycubic Viper 2 ignites 2025 Speedster Spotlight as a core XY cyclone. Its 245X, 245X, 260mm chamber, unleashing 500mm S sprints with Levi Q 3.0 auto leveling that maps 49 points for flawless adhesion on magnetic PEI sheets, snagging PCMAG's best high speed budget accolade for its vibration compensated prints that rival. Bamboo Labs A1 in layer fidelity, churning out benchy yachts in under 10 minutes with 0.05mm precision that defies its 390 tag. 
This enclosed be sealed against drafts for ABS ASA Mastery Sports, a 4.3 inch color touchscreen slicing via any cubic slicer or Orca. It's direct drive volcano hot end up to 300 dars the greasy, gobbling TPU flexibles without clogs, while silent Levi Q fans and linear rails hush hum to 40 dB for bedroom builds printing ergonomic grips or prosthetic prototypes that fit like gloves. The 32-bit board with TMC2209 drivers enables input shaping for blur-free bridges at 100 meters millimeter S, and filament dry box integration wards off moisture for consistent 1.75 dm feeds, all juiced by a 350W PSU that powers 24-7 vigils without thermal throttling. At 12 kilo, 510x468 IX, 542 mm, it perches on workshop wagons, its USB SD odd Wi Fi trio, beaming designs via Octo 4A for remote oversight, expandable with BL Touch upgrades for multi material mayhem. Valued at half Bruce's price, it claims 25% faster cold pulls and a two year warranty. Reddit R Hondar 3D printing raving about its Viper velocity on functional enclosures that seal like vaults. The textured build plate grips PETG like Velcro, and dual Z motors eliminate ghosting on tall totems, while the extruder's 70 mm S retraction curbs ooze for clean corners. Sustainable with low energy modes, it embraces 2025's recycled PLA wave outmodding Elegoo Neptunes in vibration dampening. In 2025's Extrusion Exodus. Number 3. Prusa i3 MK4 The Prusa i3 MK4 ascends 2025's reliability realm as the open-source oracle. Its Cartesian Citadel 250, EX210, and 220mm volume, with next router toolhead delivering sub-zero. Aero 5 mm layers via Super Pinda probe that auto beds 9R9 grids for adhesion artistry on powder coated sheets, clinching Tech Radar's best enthusiast FDM for its 95% first try success on ABS enclosures that shrug off engineering stresses, outlasting Creality kits in 500 hour endurance tests per all 3DP labs. At 1099's kit, or 1299s assembled, this modular maestro slices flawlessly in Prusa Slicer with input shaping for 200 mm meters at sprints. Its Bontech derived extruder up to 300 dotted crease, devouring nylons without skips, while Noctua fans and linear bearings murmur at 35 dB for library like layering of drone fuselages or medical models that scan like scans. The 32-bit Einzi board with TMC2130 drivers enables filament sensors for runout pauses and power loss recovery resumes mid-nozzle jam, all fed by a 200-wibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwibwib
It's MSLA VAT 219 X 123 X 250 millimeter volume with Cobb Plot Refractive Light Source Etching 19 micron layers for hyper detailed miniatures that rival Form Labs in fidelity, bagging CNET's best mid range SLA for its 97% cure uniformity on dental aligners or Warhammer Legions. Curing full vats in two hours with 405 nanometer wavelengths that outpace any cubic photons in shadowless subtlety per 3D sourced benchmarks. At $5,999, this tilt servo marvel slices via chichu box or lychee with auto nesting for 80 model batches, its integral heater up to 40 dadrishki, thawing winter resins for bubble free busts, while the 4K plus monochrome LCD 5760. X3600 and VP film release cleanly at 70%, less force, all ventilated by built-in carbon filters that scrub VOCs for garage-safe sculpting. The Chai 2 L6K board with silent steppers hums at 30 dB, and auto resin filling via pump refills midprint for marathon molds, powered by a 60W adapter that sips energy during 8-hour exposures. At 15 kilo, 327 x 286 x 497 mm, it stations on shelves. It's USB Wi-Fi Duo beaming STL wirelessly for remote rinses, expandable with ACF release film for 5,000 hour lifespans. Valued against Frozen's premiums, it claims 30% faster drains and a one-year warranty. Forums frothing over Saturn sorcery on figurines that flex like flesh. The VAT's silicone base bends without breaks, and UV curing station integration zaps post-process polishes, while the source's 90% irradiance uniformity unveils undercuts. Sustainable with low-waste resins, it embraces 2025's bio-based formulas, out-detailing Creality FDMs in micro-miracles. In 2025's SLA Surge, the Saturn III Pro shines spectacularly. A resin revelation fusing resolution with rapidity, arming artists with VAT-born visions that appreciate as intricately as they illuminate, proving creation crystallizes in cured clarity. Number 1. Ultimaker S7 The Ultimaker S7 Sovereign's 2025's professional pantheon as the dual extrusion dynamo, its core XY Colossus 330X240, X 300 millimeter volume with dual Bowden heads, fabricating multi material masterpieces at 500 millimeter S with active vibration compensation that layers carbon composites flawlessly, securing PC Mag's best pro FDM for its 99% uptime on aerospace prototypes that withstand 500N loads, surpassing Prusa XLs in seamless swaps per Ultimaker Academy certs. At 6950, this enclosed ecosystem slices via Ultimaker Cura with cloud fleets for 10 printer orchestration. It's swappable print cores up to 300 drowsdig seat ice, juggling nylons and TPUs without cross contams, while the 7 inch touchscreen and airflow hood up to 60 degrees tame warps for functional fuel tanks or orthopedic implants that fit like fate. The 32-bit SOC with Duet 3D drivers enables 0.025mm Z-steps and filament flow sensors auto-purge for 24-7 reliability, all sustained by a 500W PSU that idles efficiently during 72-hour builds. Weighing 23 kilos, 505X600 dollars X 750mm, it anchors workshops, its Ethernet, Ya USB Wi Fi Quintet linking to Digital Factory for remote RD. Upgradable with Air Manager for fume free factories. Priced as enterprise entry, it boasts two year warranties and Dutch durability. Autodesk raving about S7 synergy on jigs that jiggle zero. The glass door dampens drafts and dual fans forge bridges without bows while the core's 80 millimeters retraction refines radii. Eco-engineered with recycled chassis, it pioneers 2025 sustainable composites, outmodding bamboo in industrial integrity. In 2025's fabrication frontier, the Ultimaker S7 summits supremely, 
a Core XY Conqueror, fusing duality with durability, empowering pros with extrusion empires that appreciate as robustly as they replicate, where professional prowess pulses in every precise pass.